This is the Real Ass Podcast. What's the beginning of the the, What's the, the genesis, beef? The origin story. Uh, I think. Yeah, I, I see. I don't even know because I'm so I'm so selfish that I just focus on myself, and That's I good. honestly don't give a rat's ass about other podcasts or other performance. <laughs> but. Uh, there's got to be a beginning to this. What was the very first time where you were like, Nick Mullen has it out for me? What was it? I don't necessarily think he has it out for me. Um, I recalled meeting him, God, this is years ago. We were both doing comedy in, uh, in D.C. Um, at that time, I was... Washington. Yeah, Washington. Well, the Baltimore, Washington area. Got it. Um, the circuit. <laughs> yep. Which I think Baltimore and Washington together, I think, is dwarfed by the New York comedy scene. Yeah, I would, much, say, I would it's, absolutely, it's, I would agree yeah. with you <laughs> and say that New York, <laughs> it's dwarfed is actually a bigger and more <laughs> vibrant scene than Baltimore. The Washington. Greater it is Washington dwarfed, DC correct. Comedy. It is dwarfed by the Punxsutawney comedy scene. That's how small it is. Oh shit! Dropping uh, truth bombs. Okay, so so you and Nick, Minus the truth. You and Nick are both. Killers on the scene, g- coming up, getting some. Well, attention. I was already a, I was already a touring road comic. At you the were time. already out there, so Nick was a young buck coming up. You were already fucking headlining, crushing it, doing your thing. Oh, Nick yeah. comes up and HBO, BET, Showtime, all that good stuff. Were you touring? Was it regional or was it like were you all over? What was where were you touring? Um, up and down the East Coast at that okay. time. I think I'd already performed in like a dozen states okay. at that point. Okay, so, so yeah, I was I was getting not regular work, but you know, just enough that you know, I was able to be a, a reasonably established uh, comic at that okay. point. So he, you're established. Here comes Nick Mullen. Lazy, right? right? What are your first impressions of him? Give me some first impressions. Uh, pretty much my... getting by on his looks. Yeah. Now that's funny. Yeah. Uh, but uh, no. Um... First thing you see, you see this guy come in. You know, is he Jack Diesel at the time? Because he's all fucking Jack now, doggy. Does that intimidate you? It does, right? No, it's just, I just, nobody in the DC comedy community at that time really thought he was anything, anything good at that time. Oh, they still don't. shit! They wow. still don't. They he still literally don't. only has. Oh, they still shit! Don't. They still don't. Wow. Like there are probably still like there are more. Are any of them? There are, are more people curious about there like, are more, the eighty grand a month he makes. There, <laughs> there are more. That? There are more people in the in the studio at Cumtown than there are DC comics who like Nick Mullen. Oh, so, so that's three. So. Oh shit! So wow. you're saying in DC he's known as a fucking right. piece of shit. Well, I think he was in Austin, Texas for a little bit. Okay. And we know. I think even he got run out. Even he got and Austin's a pretty chill, pretty laid back city. Wow. I mean, you have to be a big douchebag if even the people of Austin say fuck off. Yeah. Wow. So he's run out of DC and then Austin. Right. He gets run out of DC, then he went and to Austin. And then his punishment was right. to live in New York, this hell. Yeah. So do you okay. and Nick ever have any kind of friendship? Not really, no. Okay. You don't know this guy. You're just. You're... I mean, I I know him. In fact, the I recorded a CD in Maryland years ago. <laughs> what was and what he was, was that on the uh, that was. You know, I don't remember. Like I think I've album? actually I've actually blocked it out of my mind. You don't. I you don't remember the, the name of your album. album. I think it was. Uh, you don't want people to find it. That's what it is. That's right. okay. It's, it's I've sold first, enough copies. I've you're... done a lot of things. I'm ashamed of Sesame Street. I'm kidding. I'm not ashamed. It's on he YouTube. It. <laughs> it's on YouTube. I produced a poker with Snuffle Up. What um. So, With, and Megan McCain and Megan McCain, yeah, I know he, that's killing it. it is. Um, so, but I'm I'm re- recording this CD, and Nick Mullen is one of the comics uh, on the bill. Words of mass destruction. Um, was that not it? that one? It okay. was uh, pitchforks, torches, and other. At least you use a really high quality photo for that. Right. For that. Pitchforks, torches. Hold on. What pitchforks, torches, and other random thoughts. Is pitchforks, the name of the... torches, and other random thoughts. Right. Okay. Wild. Okay. I like it. All right. So you record the CD. I record the CD, and Nick Mullen is one of the comics on the bill for the show. Okay. All right, so he's opening up for you. This guy is an o- your opener. No. He's one of the he's one of the comics who well, you're goes closing up the before. show. He's, so he's you, one of the comics who goes him, up. So but you had no problem with him being on the show. I mean, it's your it's your album recording. Well, it wasn't the show wasn't booked by me. Gotcha. It, it wasn't arranged. Gotcha. By me, it was arranged right. by someone else. So I just went ahead and performed. And it was recorded. it DC? You're doing this in 
Maryland? Uh, in Maryland. And you're doing an hour and everyone else is doing like showcase sets. Pretty much. Okay. So uh, Nick is your opener. For all intents and purposes, mm, Nick's your opener. One of them. Nice, nice dude. dude. So Nick, okay. So it, 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 were you, did you, were you not a fan of a set or were you like, it's okay? Well, he comes up to me. You had to play, you had to, you had to. He comes up to me during, uh, as I'm getting ready to do my set, because you've recorded a special and you're doing whatever you got to do to go ahead and make sure the set comes out right. You're I mean, I would have never, head. I would have never let somebody with a reputation like Nick Mullen at the time open up for me. He's yeah. been run out of Austin. Louis Farrakhan opened for Louis. He just wanted to. He just wanted to. <laughs> I had the crying had better, Nazi. Go, the go. crying Nazi did a tight fifteen. He had a better fifteen than Nick Mullen, the crying Nazi. Yeah, man. He's up. He's Shots up. Shots fired. Shots fucking fired. So Tommy, he opens up for you. What happens? Take us back here. He. As, what venue is it? In? We're all trying to picture this. Uh, it the venue is called uh, Sean Boland's. It's uh, an Irish pub. They do they do live shows there. Uh, Every once in a while, sounds and magical. it was <laughs> sounds the bit like the best place to record. Robin great. Williams did an album. Sounds like a fun. <laughs> <laughs> you go there, you get drunk, and I, I sound Boland? funny. Sean Boland live at Sean Boland. <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm embracing my Irish ancestry Nothing by doing wrong that. With so. that. Yeah, go see the ferryman. Uh, Baltimore. Baltimore. It's in uh, it's in uh, Bel Air, Maryland, not too far from where uh, Bel Air, Maryland. Bel Air, Maryland. Sean Boland's in Bel Air, Maryland. Bel Air, Maryland. It's okay. produ- it's produced some uh, it's produced some great. I love folks. that Maryland just steals the name of other nicer places. Like come down to Malibu, Maryland. <laughs> yes, Bel Air, Maryland. <laughs> there's a town. Like, there's no <laughs> Bel Air, Maryland. There's Not a, on fire in three weeks. Nightmare. There's a California, Maryland. Also, I'm sure it's in there the, is. So the part of the state. And Fucking it's, shysters. It's also, Maryland's a bunch of shady motherfuckers. Takes, yeah. I appreciate it though. I, appreciate I give it a little too. bit of respect. Yeah, it's also a shithole. So. Yeah. Um, yeah. But, uh, so you're at Sean Bowen's, this packed out fucking place. And Nick comes up to me and says, and asks if he, he wants to get a drink and asks if I can put it on my comics tab. And this is what year? 2013, I think. Okay. So this is, I think he had just come six, back from Austin. Six or years yeah. ago, just come back from Austin. He's right. like, hey, can I get a drink? Can you buy me a drink? Right. Essentially, and, buy me a drink. Right. And I essentially and tell you're like, him. like, I'm not a fag. I essentially First thing tell you him, said was I'm not a fag, so I'm not buying another man a drink, right? It's it's like you're in the room. I know. Louis. It's like I you're in the room. You know head, what's, yeah, we're yeah. the same guy. I get it. Mm-hmm. So what so happens? I tell him, you know, I basically tell him no, and I, there I don't have a comics tab, just because it's not exactly Sean Bolins isn't exactly a high class. <laughs> it's not a high wait class a joint. It's not Hold a real comic. Wait, wait a minute. Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> Bel Air. Are Maryland. you telling me that Sean Bolins? <laughs> yeah. Imagine Bel-Air, that. Maryland, is not exactly oh, in your words no. a high classes album. Oh event. fuck no! I mean, look at why that. did you decide to record an album at Sean Boland's? Ambiance, <laughs> ambiance, just <laughs> despair, lost hopes and dreams. Uh, Nobody ever goes there has anything was, to celebrate. What was the idea? Because you're established at this point. You're like, is it almost like the way that Dice did his album? That like uh, it was like an empty danger field. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Was that what it was it's going exactly on? exactly the way Dice did it. Are you a character? You're not like, are you not this badass of a dude that's like a character you're putting on? Are you like really a, like a nerd on the inside and then you fucking are pretending to be this fucking hardcore no, I'm motherfucker? Just, I'm, I'm just a person where I just, I just hate people in general. Okay, I like So, that. of course, uh, I have I the, I, of course, so of course I do a, I have a job where I, I talk in front of groups of people. So, that's, what is that? What, what do you do? <laughs> Don't you get a drop for that? Don't you get your no? No, oh. we just that's our good. job. It was too good. It's just... We don't pour out things. Um, so, so you, is this where it started? Nick says, "Buy me a drink." You said, "I don't have a comic." I don't have a comic. Tab. Tab. Is I don't have a I don't have a comic. Like, how tab. about you blow? This you just pull this DC. dick out. Right. He's like, Why "You know what to do." Suck my dick. This isn't the DC Improv. Right? No, it's not. This is Sean Bolin. So you pull out your cock. You're like, start sucking, bitch, and he. What Again, does he do? Does he it's suck like it? You, it's like you were in the room. Now, would you? Really and he do? just he just goes he goes off on me and says, "Yes, you do. You have a comics tab." And he just literally starts cursing me out. And now let's be honest. This room, is just yeah. between us. Did you have a comics tab? Be, and be honest. No, I did. Really? I did not. Sean, Stevie Vera, stop recording for a second. Sean, can we call I, Sean Ball? <laughs> stop recording for a second. We're, we're not recording right now. Yeah. Did you have a comics tab? No. All right, start recording again. <laughs> I believe you. 
I believe you. So he starts yelling at you, and at this point, what do you do? Do you do you have him ejected? You're the fucking you're the headliner. I if my opener, I basically, I basically my opener starts screaming in my face. Right. Okay. I would say, hey, you. My have opener to go. is fiending for some booze. Yeah. Obviously on right. fucking blow. Right. Do uh, coked out of his fucking mind. So steroids is, likely. Yeah. That's someone that his mom probably bought for him. Oh shit. Whoa! <laughs> where would she know how to get steroids though? Let's be honest. Moms don't know where to get steroids. Yeah. I think he just works out. I don't think he does, but I don't know. You brought his mom into it too. That's fucking you don't like That's this wild. guy. That's some crazy, some crazy shit. Right I there. don't do steroids. I want to clear that up yeah. because I am accused of all Wait, wait till the HIV really takes over. You're gonna need them. Yeah, I have defeated the HIV. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, cheers. <laughs> the doctors will be like, the HIV has uh, left the body. So, Tom, we're at Sean Boland's. We're in Bel Air, Maryland. Nick Mullen has asked you to buy him a drink. It's six you years have declined, ago. As is and your this right. is also six years ago. This is before Nick Mullen this really had anything going on. This is 2013. Nothing going on. He's a, he's a young guy. He looks, so up yesterday. You, looks up to you, maybe. He says you're, Likely looks up to you. You're, fucking, like you're, the, you're the local guy. At Sean Boland's. At that point, you say no, and you guys get into an argument, and is that it? Does he leave? Is that how you leave it? I literally tell him to fuck off, because like I said, you've recorded a special of course. before, and you want to you want to focus, you want to make sure everything is going right. Of course. And I'm thinking to myself, I don't, I don't need this bullshit. You can't deal with the drama. I don't need this bullshit. You don't need it. You just want to go up there. How long are you doing? 45. I think it was, well, I mean, there's, he's there's a Yankees with, game on right. at the bar. There's three other bar fights. Yeah, you got to deal with fucking all you can wings from 7 to 8 p.m. Right. Yeah. I you were probably arguing working with there. the lighting too. <laughs> so you got to do a special. You're also bar backing. It's very difficult. I'm trying to, to do like 15 different jobs done. here. Yeah, of course. Uh, How did the set go? I uh, went great. Great. Good. But was Nick gone? Did you kick him out or you said fuck off and then he just watched and crossed his arms? And, and, and pouted. And pouted. Yeah. Wow. And this is where the seed was planted. In this moment... This is where the seed was planted. This is the origin story. This is the Marvel movie. This is where Nick yeah. Mullen, you... He has it out for you. you. This is like, you know, Batman's parents being killed. You killed Nick Mullen's parents, proverbially. Proverbially. You said it right. You said it right. I got it. You, you got it, right. it, yeah. It yeah. took a lot of energy. Like, I, I feel weak. Yeah. You, are, you are a lot smarter than me. Thank you. you. I you appreciate are. that. You, you are better at math than me. You are better at speaking than me. This motherfucker, You've don't got, you? Yeah. Real ass dude of the week. Fucking Tom Myers. Give Tom it to Myers. him. Fuck it. What am I going to do? He's, he's, good. Yeah. he's a real ass dude. He's got bad ass in his. He recorded his album with Sean Bolins in Bel Air, Maryland. <laughs>